Good Saturday afternoon, everyone, and welcome back to more Slay the Spire. This time I'm going to achieve success on the daily challenge. Let's see what we got going on here. Isaac Baby, oh my god. And it's three hours in. Is that actually him? Hang on. It is. That is him. Okay. Interesting. What did he say? Try it. Okay. You know what? We're going to do it today. I was feeling the daily anyway. Also because the last daily I tried to do was just, you know, really bad. Really embarrassing. Uh, today it's the defect. Insanity, terminal, and vintage. Hmm. That's going to be great, actually. The terminal does scare me a great deal, especially with a character as frail as the defect. But, I mean, come on, if he can get a high score like that, I've got a chance as well. So you're shooting for a high score. What do you do? You need to kill every elite you can. Check one. Get past the 50 card deck. Done. Um, get a lot of relics. Well, we have vintage to help us do so. Yeah, this is just like the keys to success right now are right here before us. Let's just jump right in there. Let's go. Okay, I need to understand what's uh, so great about the deck right now. I'm, I'm looking. Obviously, you gotta do a cool headed. I'm gonna recycle a Thunderstrike so I can play pretty much everything. Ooh, that kinda sucks. Alright. Taking five off the get. No, we're taking. Only taking three. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, hopefully, everyone's having a good Saturday. Um. I'm sort of just chilling right now. There is a big sort of a get together with my friends today, but I. I don't know, I'm in a bit of a, a personal rut right now, but, you know, maybe after we're done recording this, we'll see if I'm feeling it, maybe I'll get out there and go hang out with my friends for a bit. Just need to figure out what's up with me right now. I just wanted to relax, play some games. I did get back from the dentist today, earlier this morning. It's fairly late into the evening right now. Um, so there is that. Is that the reason why I'm chilling at home? Eh, you know, maybe, right? It's always a possibility. But, like, you know... Spend most of the day here just like being unable to talk, lips being dry as hell, etc, etc. You know the, the normal, I just got back from the dentist syndromes that you tend to experience. Give me a good reboot, a multicast, huh? How about just a people's elbow? And we'll the passive damage from this guy off in the next second. Overall though, having a good Saturday. Um, oh, that's right, you play your cards twice. Dingling. Sundial, thank you. But yeah, just, just trying to relax. Enjoy my weekend, as the usual weekend will require. Hey, I think I will take the gold. Even though we're not going to be able to use it till probably the next floor. Still think we can push our limits here. And we have a goal in mind, of course. We need to, you know, not take any damage on the upcoming elite fight so we can find great success. A free recursion. And a multicast of this caliber is actually... Wow. Perfect. So thank you for that. Happy flower. Glad to have it. Okay. Up. Oh, he's not attacking. I'll actually power up this orb to great heights. Still not attacking? You know what? If you say so. Thank you very much, sir. So we got two orbs popping out, 12 damage apiece. This fight should go by pretty quickly. Yes, yeah, this is what uh, I was trying to avoid, but can't dodge him forever. Easy turn, I think. I think you just go Plasma, Rainbow, get some energy back, Aggregate, a lot of energy, play the Frosty Orb, all for one, and then, uh, couldn't evoke the Shadow Orb in time to finish him off here, so there's that. Nope, we can't do this, though. But outside, you know, my dental appointment today, uh, things are looking good for me. Uh, this was actually my, ooh... I can still fight two elites if I take this path, and I get a fireplace a little earlier. It's more or less the same. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see, is there something I can upgrade that is really going to take us off the races? I did get you at the start of my turn, so you know what? I think that is a good targeted upgrade. That was the right one. Okay, I didn't I just make sure I didn't have a second one in there that was pulling my leg. And yeah, this looks very... um orb heavy this time around, so I think this is a good upgrade to go for. You don't really have a choice on adding more cards unless we're fighting guys like this, so... I'll take it. Um... Nah, consume that thing. Seven a pop? Yeah. So remember, there's a high score on the line today. And I have a feeling... Yes, thank you. 
The success is just around the corner. Um, I should mitigate this. It will get two energy back for doing this. He's just gonna pierce through the armor I threw up anyway, so that was kind of foolish. Like, just mega foolish, actually. Um, we'll do something like Core Surge and then strike to his face. Oh, he's not gonna get through. Thank you, the extra armor. That's good. I want to keep my debuff resistance as long as I can. Okay, okay, okay. Aggregate. Insane amounts of energy. Thank you very much. Heat sinks. Gives me a lightning orb. I could have swore. I didn't play the other power. I'm a fucking moron. Um. Any zero cost in there? No. Ooh. This is a bit of a miss right now. He's only at 40 HP. And he's hidden for quite a bit. Hmm. Mm, indeed. So let's actually chill. I'm going to dual cast this for a lot of energy. We'll scrape him. Didn't get anything useful. Get a good bit of block out there and reboot. Alright. And Sunder for the kill. Very good, me. Hey. I'm playing at the top of my game today. Let's actually go. Um... I have a blizzard in here? Sorry, I'm scrolling through and as we know my mouse and keyboard setup like are both really good, so that took a minute. Would some frost orbs help out? We do have a blizzard. It's just <clears throat> not likely to be too useful. Scrape is also not likely to be too useful. I'll take another cold snap. There's nothing wrong with getting a few more frost orbs out there. Some extra defense on top of the layered walking we're already gonna be doing is gonna be very very good. Very good. Also, this is just a very nice way to start off this one. If I can have one of these multicasts back right now, I would greatly appreciate it. But you can't get everything. Mmm. We'll scrape. Didn't get what I was looking for. We will all for one. I will reboot, get some extra energy there. And is that a multicast? That is indeed the multicast. Oh, it's like absolutely unnecessary, but the thought that was there counts all the same. Hey, it's Whetstone. I was talking to one of my friends about this upgrade here. Oh, speaking of which, I did write down a conversation topic he threw at me that I just had to slap my forehead for it, but he also brought up the point of like Whetstone, what he thinks about it. Um, overall, not that impressive. Yeah, that's usually what I say about it, but the upgrade I got there was good, but he was mentioning to me, he's like, yeah, just not that good. Also, then it's Parallel Brother here, the War Paint. It's hitting some good cards, so normally. You don't have um, enough cards to really get a big boost out of that, so it's usually uh, as seen or seen as pretty pretty mediocre, I guess. And I do agree. However, sorry, I'm trying to think of the best way to do this. Two extra focus, I'll gain enough block to survive this turn. Excellent. I think you need to do... 11 damage to 1, really. And hope the lightning strikes where it needs to. Okay! There is a perfect possible with this. But yeah, I mean, that was pretty much the big point. Is like, Whetstone, you know, Warpaint, are they good? On average, yeah, it's like... It's the thought that there is, uh... That there is really nice. It's very good. But... Ultimately, you're just like, eh, I would have like been fine with pretty much anything else. Yeah, but the real contentious point of conversation that he brought up to me was, hang on, I gotta pop you. I will evoke you, good, and we'll heat sinks you. Yeah, the real contentious point of conversation he brought up to me was, and it was it's a great conversation starter. You know, goes along the lines of like our wonderful food conversations just prior, but is macaroni. A soup dish and first off I you know I heard the boy say this I'm like one like you know what you're doing right now and I'm, I'm a mad lad but to the end no it's not a soup dish are you kidding me there's no way that is a soup dish if you make soupy macaroni that's ultimately on you but like why would you do that to yourself macaroni has this wonderful texture to it that you need to have it like it can it can be rich and creamy but if you have too much cream going on like it's a sad day for everyone by the way 
Perfect fight again. Thumbs up. This is a good daily. And I was right. You should do this. Some more Glacier. That's, that's some more block. I don't mind it. Get a fish out the blizzard. I would like a hologram in the mix now. If that is possible. Mmm. Mmm. Very good. We'll do something like this, just to ensure I have enough block to survive the damage that they can throw out here. He's gonna shield- yeah, he's gonna shield the Kamehameha guy. AoE, please. I need some AoE. So what do you do here? You turbo. Good play, I know. Then you... All for one. Get back turbo. Cool-headed. Overclock. Turbo again. All for one. Turbo. <laughs> Overclock. We're we're going places right now. Another frost orb. Another frost orb. And some buffer. Okay. And all of a sudden, uh, I feel like we have a frost deck on our hands, even though we didn't really add too much to the mix to get us here. That's sort of what the game's throwing at us here again. Probably a little overkill there, but... We are sort of whittling away at these guys, and they are getting a little stronger. So if I can throw out 30 blocks in a turn and just get a little damage in there, I don't mind. Uh, Rip and Tear is likely just to finish him off, so... What do you mean likely? It absolutely is. Tori is huge, and I think one of the best trinkets on the defect these days, outside of what it used to be with Mummified Hand, but Mummified Hand still being a top quality yet. Is there anything I want here? Is there anything I would like to... Sort of upgrade here. Yeah. Or something I want to transform. Also, yeah, but... Transform into what? Like, I mean, I transform that strike into something else. Wait a minute, no. Wait a minute, yes. Wait a minute. Hmm. I apologize. Again, we've had this issue where I just take so long in some turns recently, but it's, it's just the way it is, because there's a lot of thought that are going into my moves these days, and I'm thinking I'm going to upgrade buffer. Why upgrade buffer? Turns where I have extra armor, having multiple turns of taking zero damage against elites or bosses that I want to perfect. It's gonna be worth my time. Case in point right now, I will gladly fight this elite. Just kidding. They won't give it to me. They assume my score is already too high for this to count. An aggregate. Oh, I should have upgraded aggregate. If I can duplicate aggregate, that's what I'm gonna do. That's that's power waiting to happen right there. You go wham. Spam, Kablooey, Kachow. They want to evoke this five times? Yeah, I do. -ta 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 -ta. Not enough for the kill. So we're taking a bit of damage. The armor's been uh, keeping us alive, thankfully, but if we're taking any damage along the way and we're not getting HP, we're going to be in a bit of trouble. Ooh, those are good potions. Do not, do not rest. You had 49 HP. That is actually the perfect amount for the Hexabud. You need to... Making that innate would probably be good. Frosty Orbs extra on the first turn. Yeah. That's going to be useful for a lot of reasons. Normally for the three Musketeer fights on the second floor, just to have enough block to endure. Right now, it's good purely because of the amount of um, damage I'm going to be taking on the first turn here. Storm will echo form. Static Discharge, just for the extra orb. Chill to get some damage out there. Okay. Nine turn of block for free right now. That's good. We need to get a little bit more here. Good. Um. Turbo is not what I was looking for. I'm, I'm throwing it all over the wall here because I do want to get the perfect now. It's not happening. Okay, that's fine. Um, I think you might have been pretty hard pressed to get a perfect here. And the amount of damage we did on the first turn there is nothing to uh, scoff at. So overall, a good start. And lots of good damages coming out here. If things were just a little different, maybe that would have been uh, doable. If I would have got my leap in the mix there, we could have done it. Oh well. 
I ain't gonna cry about it, although I already am, if you can't tell by the tone of my voice. No, I'm kidding. He's already dead. Damn, we could have done it, though. Disappointment. Um, Amamori is, you know, it's debatable if I should have taken that, actually. Some curses would have gone a long way in this deck. Forgiveness power. And a second echo form is more than okay. No. Well, no, because there's some turns with aggregate we can have an insane turn. I'd rather not. I think I'll take Ori. Some extra cards won't hurt. Uh, yeah. That's sort of the thing I was talking about. Let's think about the other options first, or at least look at them. Mm-hmm. Seek is so good. It's actually probably the best card in the game. No hold bars. Auto shields could come in handy. Depends on the uh, relics we get later. I'll take it. A little extra defense. Again, a little extra defense. I think charge battery is going to be better in that regard. A little less block, but it gives us such a good upside. Good reason not to take it. Any draw potential is fine, because at the moment we get into a situation where we can um, get massive amounts of energy and draw with it, I will be a happy lad. 500 gold, second floor, looking for some elites. I'm seeing Wham, Bam, or earlier shop, even earlier shop, Wham, Bam. Oh, there's like three fireplaces over there as well? What's the path here giving me? Just one? You'd be a fool not to take more for free. Alright. Here, you get, you get Echo Farm on the first turn. It's a bit of a miss, because I can't play it. I mean, I could, but, like, I'll get a little bit more out of the game by doing this. Hmm. I meant to click Glacier, and that is the honest truth. Uh, so we'll take one damage. It's fine, because we're just going to get chunked away from the uh, curse regardless, but that was not the intent. Aggregate. Oh, my God. Infinite energy is totally an option now. So for now, we'll just take the block. Like, if I multicast one of these, it we break the game. The extra three damage is also good there to lower the armor. Yeah. So taking the one damage, like I said, not a big deal, especially with the curse that we're constantly losing HP. But if I can, let's go overclock. Turbo. Buffer. Sweeping beam. All for one. Turbo. Er, turbo? <laughs> turbo. Overclock. Let's play Storm. Get some more block on the table. Rip and tear. PK Sunder. Alright, he's dead. Calipers. It further furthers the idea of a frost egg being a good way to go. So let's see what options we have available here to influence that. Maybe. Mmm, that's good block. Some extra orb slots are good. Some extra block is good. This will be situationally good. There's a few bosses I would like it against. This is not one of them, but it wouldn't hurt. Deep Breath. Gotta take it. Enlightenment, I think, is also worth grabbing. What a surprise. Like, everything was worth grabbing here. Uh, an energy potion. So, we just blew our entire um, savings account here. So, if we ever had a dream of retirement, that is now in the garbage. But, we have so many tools to really enable Sundial. Extra energy, being able to play more of these expensive cards. It's gonna be worth it. That being said, play this. That's an extra bit of block. Stay with me. Extra bit of what? Extra bit of energy. Which I don't mind. This guy can hit me for one if he wants. Again, the HP will just come back as a loss anyway. Extra energy so we can play more wonderful cards, such as Echo Form and Storm. So the sooner we can evoke this on a turn where we have a lot of good going on, the better. Also, this person's debuff does absolutely nothing to us in the current state we are in, so don't mind it. Actually, just outright ignore it if possible. Don't think it's worth playing Recursion on this, because there's nothing we're going to get out of it. So we'll just do a little bit of damage. Get the Shuriken that I actually forgot existed, and we'll keep pushing through. Mm, that's a cute bit of damage. Would it be a shame if I just aggregated twice? <laughs> right. Um. So that was probably not the right play. Although... You could turn any card from the discard pile. What would you grab? Anything with draw? Frost orbs? Yeah. I'll do that. I'll grab Cool Headed. Give me some draw. Give me some energy. Give me a Meteor Strike. I'll play everything here. As you might imagine. 
And I just realized how good Enlightenment is with Meteor Strike right now. Oh my god. My mind has just been blown by that possibility in a regular run. Hmm. We've learned something today. We've learned a very good lesson. A very good. Also, that energy doesn't really do anything outside of, you know, looking cool. And then we take one damage thanks to Tori. Uh, Tori's going to be the, the saver right now. Overclock. You're dead. Yeah, you're dead, kid. Okay. Very good. Bottled Lightning. Choose a skill to start with that's upgraded. Leap is fine for blocks. We're already starting with that. I was about to click my chill. Give me the cool-headed plus. Even more possibilities for our energy combos to take off right now. There we go. That is a decent start. Uh, get everything on the table, by the way, because this guy's about to do some pretty annoying moves to you that you'd rather not hear about. All right, good. Played everything. We got massive amounts of energy. Would like my orb slots to come out a little quicker. Possible buffer. What's your price? The flight. Okay, play buffer. Play deep breath because that gets the sundial propped. A little extra energy. I'll evoke this twice for 24, and I will get another frost orb on the table for just outstanding amounts of block. I love frost orbs. If there was a time in my <laughs> Slay the Spire running career, I don't know, like a, a career or something. Um, if I ever look down on this card, please let me know. I was a fool and a charlatan. It's actually amazing. Frost orbs are the de facto way to go, if not like the slowest way to go, I think. Very good nonetheless. You're still not hurting me, so double sweeping beam. You're extra not hurting me. This is great. I think, uh, so I'm seeing, you know, why I was recommended by Mr. Northern Lion there. Hey, you should try this. It is good. It is very good. So good, I keep doing the mean voice. And more frost orbs. Yeah. He just tail whipped me, but like I got so much block on top of it, and the calipers are just making sure it actually stays there. I can't be hurt. Um, this turn we'll toss away leap. Oh. We'll toss away Streamline, just because I think this will fish out something. Well, it fished out Recycle again, which is kind of hilarious. Give me back... Yeah, give me back this. For two? That dunks him. Could have done that a little sooner. Apologies. Birdface Urn, thank you for that. Not amazing, but the Relic does help add to that Relic collection. Just chill, my dude. Hold... Defrag first. We will rainbow next. And then we will chill. Good. A lot of damage out there. Lots of frost coming out. I would like my blizzard. So give me seek so I can fish out blizzard a little bit quicker here. And do auto shields. I was going to say auto shields. No, you can't. The game won't let you do auto shields. See? Yeah. It's like the thought that counts. We really need blizzard to come out so we can um, clear out these guys before they ramp way too hard. And uh, that is a concern right now. Mm-hmm. Fusion, charge battery, storm, that discharge. Oh, that's right, we have the, the power chaining thing. I could have played something there, and I probably should have, but if I can save it for the elites, I want to. Okay. Capacitor, it's huge. Of course, this is, this is just raw damage. I think that's pretty much what I need. Any zero cost in here that I would fish back? Turbo and Enlightenment? I can play everything if I do this, so... And it's 10 damage. Get the block. Okay. This is gonna be an... An painful turn? A painful turn, sorry. Multicast. Yeah. Yeah, hang on. Bring me that. Um, I would like to recycle this, I believe. Absolutely would like to recycle this. And then we will multicast. That was not the right choice. It was a good choice, but it wasn't the right one. Okay. Panicking aside, we've done it, but 
HP is just in a terrible spot. We have the potion that will keep us alive, and the pear is absolutely something I was hoping to grab. Okay, this is this is the fight where I want the chill. So uh, here we say no chill. Or we have no chill, but you know what? Okay, get the joke, god damn it. Um, play storm, play chill. Cool headed. Capacitor. It's just a lightning orb, which is needed. And recursion gives us a little bit more block, which is kind of needed. Let's think. 4, 8, 12, 5. Okay, 12. Plus 5. 17. Plus 7. 17 plus 7. 24. Need a little bit more block. Understood. Um, targets to get rid of first? You. Is it worth it to throw a potion at this guy right now? It, it could be a better turn, right? There is absolutely a better turn in the the works. So we're gonna say no. Lightning's really going after him, which is fine. I would prefer to get rid of him because he has that really obnoxious attack. He's not doing it yet, thankfully, but he does have it. You know the one. Overclock. Full headed. And frost damage is good, and. I'm hard pressed right now to think of a better turn. Okay. So do we have enough block by doing this? Yes, but this guy's about to do like that annoying attack. I think we need to push the envelope. Go for the scrape. Didn't get what we were looking for. Get a darkness orb on the table. And we need to rush to evoke that if a little or if a little. Um a lot sooner if possible. Yeah. He's still not attack or doing his thing. Um So we'll get a reshuffle going on here. Glacier is huge. Glacier is so huge. It gives me all the block I could ask for. And it enables Blizzard to just wipe the floor with a lot of the enemies here. So thank you. Streamline will not get rid of you. So we do need to block. Okay. I threw a lot at this one, but I think it was worth it. And it turns out it looks like it's going to be worth it. Um, can I hologram anything of value? Blizzard, yeah. Hologram Blizzard. And play it and strike him. Good! Another perfect in the book. A data disc is just outstanding and the agent potion is nice to have. Overclock. Right now I'm not concerned about drawing more burns on the rebound. I'm concerned about actually getting my power cards on the table. That's an option. Um, that's so tempting. Again, I think I go for... I'm gonna go for you. Anything that gives me more cards right now seems like the way to go. Uh, this is a tough choice. A few bad turns that I'm just done for. But if I take this, I, I can push the envelope of getting perfects like crazy. Ooh, that's the risk. This is the risk we take. Uh... I don't know. This is hard. So I get five cards in a deck of 63. Chances are if I don't draw one in between some certain turns, I'm just fucked and I'll have, what, 30 HP to work with? I'm gonna refuse. I still think we have it in us to get a very high score without that. That's such a good get. Um, so, yeah. Say no to that. For me, at least. Aggregate. Defrag. Let's get a fusion on the table and then let's chill. If I multicast this and get like a billion things, I'll be the happiest boy in the world. Feels good. Come on. You could grab any card in the world from this deck. What would you grab? You know what I'm grabbing. I just upgraded it. Three more cards. And there's a deep breath in there, so... Even more energy and some more cards. If you could grab one card from... Hey, wait a minute. That's not what I was thinking would happen there. Uh, I misunderstood. Consume's still fine. I thought I was about to really pop off there, but it wasn't as big as I thought. Still good. Still a very good turn. Block him. Block him. That's 
fine. He's gonna do the healing thing, isn't he? Yeah, mad annoying. Aggregate. There we go. Heat sinks. Storm. Draw a card. Capacitor. Slot. Draw a card. Hit him. Hit him very hard. Overclock. Deep breath. Good, good, good. We have a train here. We'll hit you. We'll cool head it so we can get some damage. Cool head to get some damage. Overclock. Okay, and turbo. Alright, consume. Things are a little bit stronger. Recursion. Could have been better. Force field, extra block. Play this. Get the energy back. Aggregate again for even more energy. Streamline. Play the darkness orb. Get that frost orb out of there. Get this extra energy. Alright. Limitless potential with this one. Easy. Easy. Dual cast. Recursion. Overclock. Oh, look, a burn. Eh, doesn't really matter. There we go. Alright, Lantern. Lovely. Steroid Potion. Just average. What do we do here? You don't rest. You upgrade. You upgrade to the skies above. Anytime I get Seek, I'm going to be so happy. Like, really, is there is there a... Hmm. Innate Lightning. Good damage. Or upgrade Seek. I could make some of these cards innate that would guarantee me guaranteed damage. I know. Can't get more guaranteed than guaranteed damage. But I think the Frost opener we have most of the time is the defense we do need. And, like, in this case, like, yes. I will do this. It'd be a fool not to. Let's overclock in the mix there. That's a good opener. Don't, don't let anyone tell you that's not a good opener. We have some good things going on right now, and it would be a miss to not do them. Yep, doing that. That's a very good start for us. The extra strength up, the amount of frost we have on the table, those are the things we like to see. I can't auto shield, so I don't even, don't even try. Turbo. Frost. All for one. Turbo. Block. Overclock. All for one. Get him back. Do it again. My deck is on fire. Multicast, huh? Now that's something to talk about. I think getting a Darkness Orb in the mix will help for later. Getting an energy orb will help with energy issues, and he's not hurting us, so... Yeah, this is a fine little mix of orbs we got going on here. We got all four on the table. Storm. Good. Take a deep breath. Beam, beam, Alright, alright. Consume is fine. We lost a frost orb for that, but everything's gonna get a lot stronger, except for the plasma orb, of course. Forgot you had friends. You're many, many merry minions. Go darkness orb. Charge battery. Another frost orb. People's elbow? Nah. Thunderstrike? Yeah. Oh wait, you can do this. I can recycle that back if I want. Um. Yeah, that works for me. And then we'll get extra energy for next turn. So he's actually going to do a big attack here because his bud's still alive. But because we have so much block, I keep forgetting I have calipers. That's the reason why I'm finding great success. Also, everyone's dead. Yeah, calipers is actually insane. And I think liquid bronze is going to do better than that potion. Two chills. Interesting. I don't know if I want to upgrade that one. I think that might be too much chill. But we'll see. Frag. Get the heat sinks out there. Mummified hand would be a nice additional uh, get, let's say. Play cool headed. Play auto shields. Play chill. Good. No damage. Six a turn. We'll be done with this guy in roughly 11 turns if things keep up. Another chill. Eh. Play storm. Mm. Well, not the best turn. But again, still not getting hurt, and 
I was joking about the whole 11 turns to kill thing, so if I could get some damage in here, I'd be happy. Thank you. We'll do it like that, just because I don't want to lose these uh, defensive options I have here. They are serving us very well. Two sweeping beams. Seek a way out. Find a door with the nine and seek a way out. You guys know what that game's about, right? <laughs> if you don't, you should. We'll do Overclock. Oh, I that's right, I get to pick two. Overclock and... Reboot of all things. So why this? Because I have Enlightenment, I can make... I was gonna say, I can make all of these cheaper. Which is cool. But that only really applies if, um... You have something to make cheaper to begin with. So here, it's like, hey, Multicaster 1 is fine. Good damage. Reboot. Pop Sundial right now, and then we can just probably kill this guy. And if not, we'll play Buffer, get the uh, Lightning out there, some extra block. He should be dead next turn. Is anyone a fan of those games? I love 999, by the way. I love the, the entirety of that game series. Nice little game to uh, fuck with your head, I guess. Although the last one in the series, I don't know. There's uh, some issues with it. Oh my god, you would. Sure. Ginger is... I, mean, I want turn up, actually. But Ginger's fine. Um, yeah, really good games. Definitely give those a try if you're a fan of puzzle games. Um, I think over just getting the overclocks means... This upgrade here allows us to get to... Way more cards than I normally would have. So good opener here is that into the meatball. And then you chill, get some energy. Cool headed, get some energy. Cool headed, get some energy. Alright, we're off to the races. We're looking, we're looking. Oh man, are we looking so hard. What do you do here? Storm? Buffer. Hands down. What a good opener. Two turns of block. Lots of frost coming out, so we have block stacking with calipers. You beautiful game. Okay. Why this? You'll see in a second. Check it. Ready? You're watching, right? Eyes open. You go wham! Give me these back. Turbo. Overclock. Let's go. Overclock. Let's go. It was going to be much better than this, I promise. I think I might just play a billion blocks, to be fair with you. This would be... I'd be a miss not to play this, right? That's good. Um. Yeah, we're just going to play a bunch of blocks. Sorry, Echo Form. The ability to defend myself, I should have drank this like a minute ago. Really. Uh, is just too good to pass up. So the force field is outstanding. The glacier's good. Lightning strike the guy on the left. Yes! Keep the blockchain going. So I actually want to just keep frost orbs out here forever. Because it really just lets me... You want to give me something that's good? Further stack up the blocks with calipers, which means we won't take any damage. Negate the... Man, eh, like, negates the one thing I didn't care about. But it really just enables us to go a lot further. And this is good, because now we get a extra bit of energy. You know what? I just told you why this is a good idea. And I'm not going to not do it. Every time we evoke these things and we're getting extra block because of it... Uh, we're only losing 15 a turn. He's not attacking us, so... We get to stack it up pretty high, and then Blizzard starts hurting a lot, too. Scrape him. Not good enough. Blizzard, strike. Strength up. I, I could have Darkness Orb there. I don't think I want to. I just want to keep these on as long as I can. This helps out so we can have more things in the mix. Oh, two, huh? Interesting. Oh, All for One's about to make us pop off. Hmm. 
<laughs> oh, game. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we're running into some energy issues here. And by energy issues, I mean uh, my hand's too big issues. Which is a good problem to have. Don't let me tell you that's not a good problem to have. Okay. I don't just want to multicast here. Sorry, I'm like muffling my voice over here. Hey. Multicast one of these for 55 whole damages. Hmm. I have no frost orbs on the table. That scares me. Void sucks. I have no frost orbs on the table, um, so we're gonna lose this uh, block pile we built up a lot quicker now. We need to get that back out on the, the battlefield here. There's some block for you. A little bit more block if you don't mind. Okay. And yeah, more blocks. Blocks on tops of blocks on tops of blocks. Good. If I evoke this, I win. I'm also going to turn on the light. So I'm playing in the abyssal dark here. There we go. Did I mention it's like 8 o'clock and the sun just went down? That's pretty much why that's happening. Hey, you're dead. Yo, this is going really well. I'm liking the daily kunai. Yes, please. Um, another reboot? Yeah. For the setup we got going right here. Thank you. Curse key? Yes. Because the curses won't affect us, extra energy is just always good. The health, probably an option there, but if we're not getting hit, you know, knock on wood. Let's uh, get some more energy on the table to play more cards. No triple elite here? No, only a double. How about fireplaces in between? There's a shop early. So you got one, two, three there, and if you go here, you got one, two. Yeah, well, hug right. Oh great, hopefully we don't get the mask event before we spend all our money. And we'll go from there. Turbo, yeah. Defrag, yeah. Now just charge into a cool headed. Ooh, into one of these puppers. And then one of these for some blocks and the great stuff. Okay. I am actually I'm loving the daily, so I'm glad I checked out <laughs> another opinion on that before we started here, because this is this is just actually a lot of fun. I haven't had one of these in a while. I think these are the sort of runs that made me think dailies were easy, but... You gotta remember, even though these make dailies perceived as, like, easy, it makes them a lot of fucking fun as well. And that's just a nod to myself there to... Not mock the dailies, even though I haven't done that in a while. Like, you know. Come on. Snake Lady. You know I hate her. You know I hate her with a burning passion... ...in my heart. Mostly because of her sidekicks here being mad annoying. For reasons undiscussed. Cursion. Why are we doing that? Hey, we got calipers. May as well. Keep the blockchain going. Okay, if we want that. And I could super evoke that as well. That is an option. Hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> Okay. What two do you want? I think this works. You play these, you all for one, get them back. Yep. That's the combo right there. I need to keep that in mind anytime we get the seek. Oh, and then you can enlightenment everything here and... I take it back. Things can get better. I think I'd rather keep you on... Board for extra block. Nah. Give me 16 right now. Because we're going to lose 15 here in a second, so. And we've got plenty of things that'll give us block. Like this, for instance. There you go. Like this. I'm all for one. And then we can just do this absurd play one more time. So, excuse me while I get everything. And now I can meatball for, for free. So, uh, yeah. We'll meatball for free. And then he dies. Good. Question card. Why not? I only get cards from elites, but I'll take it. Sensory stone? Yeah. What can you get me here? I think deep breaths are fine, especially with a sundial. Again, deep breaths are... 
are so good. I think that you might be saying that's too many deep breaths. If I draw all my deep breaths and I can just shuffle these out, I'm gonna get so much energy in one turn. It's like I basically am doing the turbo play. So that's that's great. Um, eh, just that's just okay. Loop, yeah. You, yeah. Um, weaving beam, yeah. Why not? Cool. Spend all our money. Uh, this is the best time to do so because if we get the event with the um, the mask. We're going to want to make sure we have no energy on hand. Chill. Recursion. I, I'm going to spend all my energy here, so bear with me. No we'll deep breath. Get a lot. By a lot, I mean this much energy back. Hit you with one of these. All for one. Play this again. Get the energy refreshed one more time. Just a little more block. And then we will blizzard. And slaughter everyone. Yo, if I had a gremlin horn on this as well, I think I'd just steamroll straight to the boss. No if, ands, or buts about that. Like, I'd just be able to get so much energy off of fights like this. Nice and simple. Oh, strawberry, thank you. Hmm, do you want the focus potion? Uh, yeah. I'm gonna save that for the final boss fight. That is gonna be my crutch. Thinking the extra energy. What does this do? Draw even more cards. From the reshuffle. Hmm. 16 block. I mean, that's already going to be free on most cases. Ah, it's, again, we're at another tough choice here. I think I'm going to upgrade Hologram. So it turns out I can get these uh, guys rotating back in my hand. Going to have some good openers and some good closers and some good finishers. Just good everything with the current lineup. Okay, so we'll chill. We're, we got an interesting turn here. It's, it's real interesting. <laughs> On how we approach. So I will deep breath now, get the sundial tracker going up a little bit higher. We're going to meteor strike. You know, but why would you do that? Well, I can reboot, get some extra energy, and if I evoke any of these, like with a multicast, all of a sudden I've got four energy. It's not that good, but then I could do a turn like this. I can grab myself a You know what? The absolute madman is feeling... Hang on, hang on. For some reason, I think I have Sneko's eye, like, constantly, and that's not the case. <laughs> so hold the phone. We'll grab that. Yes. We'll grab all for one. Also, yes. We'll overclock. I should have not grabbed that, actually, now that I think about it, but it's okay. Deep breath. Get the extra energy. Let's play this for the power energy. Play multicast for infinite energy here. Hologram. What's in the discard pile? Deep breath. Hologram out. Deep breath. Play it. Play cool headed. Play dual cast. Glacier. We will all for one you. Deep breath again for extra energy. You only get one card, which is a deep breath, so we can get even more energy. Get some more block on top of it. Recursion one of these guys. I should have done the Darkness Orb a little sooner. Play this. We're not doing any damage, but we aren't taking any either. And this will only last for like maybe a turn or two more, so we really need to get the kill power going here. Or the kill pressure, I should say. Hologram, deep breath. Play it. Hmm. Hologram back, deep breath, play it again. That's a fine get. And I think I will get some energy on the table. We will blizzard, a little extra block. If I push this to the front, I'm just going to get a lot of kills here. Although, there are some dangerous turns coming up. Turbo, yes. Rainbow, yes. I know that might have been a little excessive because there's a chance that lightning could have done it. Didn't want to take the risk there. And I've got something good going on as far as energy gain, so let's keep that where it is. 
Enlightenment's huge. Overclock. Echo form. Storm. The meatball is going to give us energy and probably kill this guy if I'm not mistaken. Or get close to killing him. Oh, right. I had played some uh, cards beforehand here. Excuse me while I filter through the mess that is my life and my deck here. All right, he's dead. Good perfect, guys. Good perfect. Shovel. I, I don't know. Second blizzard. Yeah. That is a win condition to the highest degree. And I am going to upgrade my blizzards now because I realize... Who am I fighting? It's Time Lord! I am a little scared. I'm a little scared of Time Lord. If this is my condition for it, um, so be it. They had to give me Time Lord. That's like gonna be the one thing that throws a wrench in the plan. Hey, remember how I said if I got that, things would be pretty crazy? Yeah. Nice. And this guy, this guy sucks. He's really annoying. I hate him. Let's get some frost out there. Let's just get some everything out there, really. 32 damage? Yeah, why not? We're about to throw this entire hand away anyway, so let's do that. Uh, turbo again. Fusion Orb. Darkness Orb. Glacier. And you may think it's a waste any time we get something like that. Anytime I can squeeze out a little bit of block on the extra turn, it's good. Take a door with a 9. Now how do you break it here? Easy. I have one all for one already. Get me... Get me a turbo, please. Turbo. One of these. Turbo. Play this. I could all for one right now. I could get it for cheaper. I think we'll do it like this. No, let's cool head it first. Then we'll enlightenment. Oh, Jesus. And now you've broken the game. Wait, it just doesn't even matter. Outside of just getting a bunch of blocks, so I might be wasting everyone's time here. In fact, I know I'm wasting everyone's time here because all I'm doing is getting strength ups and like infinite energy I can't do anything with. Yeah, I mean, uh, getting that's good. It's, so it's pretty much just here to fish myself up some more block, uh, which is fine. Perfectly fine. Good. Alright. We're taking 40, but we have 115, so we can survive like two more turns of that. And echo form. And then you, pl you evoke this for energy. And overclock gets you something you like. Do I have zero cost in there? I have overclock. And deep breath. Two voids. Jesus. This is, like, an embarrassingly disgusting hand. Play this again for the extra energy. The multicast for a lot of damage. Oh yeah, that's... That's a play. Alright. 24 HP left. I just gotta survive his turn here. Hopefully he's not doing 40. He's doing exactly that. Cool-headed, please. And some more cool-headed. Incursion. I should have played Recycle. It's fine either way. Blocks will hold, and we will as well. 18. No, dead. Is another perfect? There, there's something to be said about taking that one. I'm not sure if that was the right play, but any orbs I get early on are just going to get evoked, so it's just free damage, really. Oh, dear me. Oh, dearie me. So nothing's getting evoked. The energy orb will get evoked. The frost... I mean, the darkness... That, yes, those, that will get evoked. I know exactly what I'm saying. Mm hmm I mean, that was actually just not a good play. Just gave myself some uh, void status. Yikes. Okay. Force field twice. That's good. Deep breath. Energy on the table. Turbo's good. Hit him with that. I think this is a fine play again. Gets rid of the annoying boy there. Gets me some more block. Some more block, and I'll summon an even larger block. Alright, there. Please, hit me as hard as you can, I encourage you right now. Okay. 37, no, that's actually a combo I never really get to see. You do it like this. And maybe I should have done it like that, actually. Big oops. 
extra energy. They're cool headed. Thank you. Still fine. So this guy. Oh, he just dies because I have actual damage on the table. Oh, and the Gremlin Horn actually wasted my uh, good card there. Believe me, I'm crying right now. Um. So I'll do this. And I also know I have Echo Form, but it's just it's just giving me that extra damage. If these guys do hit me, they actually will just eviscerate themselves, so sort of encourage them not to do that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was gonna say, odds are he's gonna die. Why am I wasting time with this? Uh that trinket does nothing. I did not get the mask at all here. Singing bowl. So that's the only big uh, bonus we're not getting is for the HP. Oh, okay. I look like a fool for upgrading anything now. A tentacle lad here might give me some issues. He's done it before and you can do it again. Order was very important there. So, yeah. You know what's coming. All for one. Oh, oh. My game actually stuttered while I did that. I actually had a mini heart attack. I thought something bad had happened. Enlightenment here. So the energy goes a little further. So we will all for one. Turbo. Static discharge. Overclock. Enlightenment again. Alright. Do you do this? This? Then this? Lots of frost. I know. Hologram back the turbo, extra energy. We'll reboot, and we're looking for, I mean, this is actually fine. It's so much block. Let's get some powers on the table. Streamline, hologram, streamline. It's just a very basic play there for a good bit, good bit of damage. And uh, making that cost zero, so it also gets affected by this. Thank you. And that's just speeding up the fight for us. It's uh, a little bit of damage. I like the animations on Tentacle Boy here now. Before, he used to just sort of flail around. And more or less, he is doing exactly that still, but... You know what I mean. Alright. Lightning's coming out. We still have a lot of block that is carrying over. Apotheosis basically seals the deal. Oh, uh, wait. This kills him. But Apotheosis will seal the deal on the boss fight. And... That egg doesn't do anything. We don't need to upgrade anything else, because if we get Apotheosis, it's basically a done deal. Let's dig up one good relic. Marbles for the opener. Don't hate it. Alright, let's go. Skyrocket in sight. Perfect game in mind. So I'm going to be very overzealous on my openers here. Yeah. Just because I think getting that extra energy out early is going to really help out. And any block I can throw out there before he starts ramping up in strength is important as well. You can play two things here. You can, you can play two things here. You can play one thing here, and I think that was the right choice. I forgot Echo Form works like that. So we want to end on odd numbers if possible. Deep breath twice to get two cards. Apotheosis. Let's get that. Let's play this. Heat sinks. That's good for the blocks. That's not ending on an odd number either. Um, another miss. Uh, two chills. Yes. I'm thinking, is it possible to get enough block out of this? It is. Meteor striking first is not the play. All for oneing is. I can overclock. Play buffer. Cold snap. Good damage. 
I will reboot this hand. Kind of hurts. Yeah, that was actually not the play, because it doesn't reshuffle the energy. Mmm. Shit. Yeah, that was not the play. This is... 100%, okay. Lots of energy. Lots of block. He's getting strong, and I need to start hitting him. Um... Okay, we have a fresh turn here. You deep breath. Get the energy from it. Good blocks. There's very good blocks. That's pretty much what we have going. How much am I blocking for? 104, he's hitting for 32. Yeah, this is a nice turn to do this. It's not a lot of damage in all honesty. Um, dual cast one of those for 20. All right. As long as we can keep this going, and we have two turns of a uh, block damage coming up as well. It's 22 damage, not a lot. Extra blocks, or extra energy for next turn. Really need him to purge that. Okay, he's doing the purge. This is good for damage, but I need to get Glacier on the table. Okay, I think we've done it. <laughs> It got a lot more serious towards the end than I thought, but I think this is good. Oh, yeah. Oh, would I multicast this for five? Uh, fuck yeah, I would. In fact, I would even also um, get the energy to swap over, or do this swap over right now, just because it does help us out a little bit more. And all I need to do is draw my uh, super attack and we win. Still lots of block. I, I need to end it quickly because I can only do this for so long, and I've said that so many times, but it's the honest truth. Blizzard for 35. Thanks for watching, guys. This was a good daily. You need to play today's daily. Alright, let me see the score. Ooh, just quad ones. That's not bad. The real question is... Is it a score that puts me among the greats? No, I didn't beat him. Thir 1344, he's an actual god. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. With his many misplays in his videos. He is a god when it actually comes to video games. It's it's like... How the hell do you get 200 more points on this run? That's what I want to know. Regardless, thank you for watching, guys. July 15th daily was a good time. Gonna get this up and going. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday evening. Enjoy the rest of your weekend in general. And I'll see you on the next one.